Hi guys, in this video, I'll show you how to use Google Meet on laptop. First of all, open up your preferred browser and search for meet.google.com. Now, you will be redirected to this web page. Here, you will find different options, but in the meeting section, either you can start a new meeting or just join an existing meeting by using a specific code. Now, click on start a new meeting Select start an instant meeting and your Google meeting will start. After your online meeting has started, you will be able to find different options on your home screen. Here, you can enable or disable your microphone during meeting and you can also toggle on and off the camera. After that, you can turn on subtitles for your meeting and you can send the emoticons to your team members. There is also a present now option here and a raise hand feature during meeting if you have any question. You can also leave the meeting by clicking on this red button. Now, click on present now button at the bottom of your screen and a pop-up will appear. There will be various options present inside this pop-up like you can share your window screen, your entire screen or share your browser screen. All tabs that are running in your Chrome will appear here. I have only one tab that's why it is showing Google Calendar here. But if you have YouTube running in your Chrome, make sure to toggle on this audio share tab because it will share the audio of your tab as well. Now, click on Google Calendar or any tab that you have opened in your Chrome and then click on the share button. During screen sharing, you have various options to control your screen. By clicking on this icon, you can remove or block any person or just toggle on and off the video of your shared screen and also unpin your screen. Now, let's move to the other options. If you click on this icon, it will give you the details of your meeting. You can copy your meeting link and send it to others so they can join your meeting. After that, click on this two persons icon to add members in your meeting. Now, in the chat section, you can chat with your members during the meeting. Then, in the activities section, you will find different activities that you can use during your meeting. Now, click on this host control option and you will find a bunch of options to control your meeting as a host. After that, click on the three dots icon to open up your settings and inside it, you will find different options like you can change the layout of your meeting, you can change to tilted, spotlight or sidebar layout of your meeting screen and you can also open your screen in picture mode. Now, let's end our meeting and go to Google Calendar. Here, you can schedule your Google Meetings for later. So, select the date you want to schedule the meeting on and then click on that date. After that, a new pop-up will appear on your screen. Now, in this pop-up, first add title of that specific scheduling and then click on Add Time option. After that, select your preferred time, click on Add Google Meet Video Conferencing option and your scheduled profile has been created. So that's all for this video. If this video was helpful, don't forget to subscribe and hit the like button. Thanks.